three days to go. The moment of truth arrives. Empowered by courage, I prepare to take flight. And in that moment, I found my fearless. You're watching Ride Comparisons and Hyperia is the eighth roller coaster at Fort Park. So what better way to count down the last seven days than with the roller coasters that we already have. So three more days to go. So roller coaster of the day is my favorite ride in the park at the moment. Let's go check out Stealth. Bring it on. 24th of May, Fort Park changes forever. Coaster of the day. On today's countdown for Hyperia episode, we've got my favorite roller coaster in the park. Oh, I love it so much. So this is probably the quietest um, place in the stealth area. If you've never seen it before, guys, if you walk left to the entrance, there's actually a little garden down the back of stealth. It's quite tranquil, actually. So here we go, guys. My favorite in the park. Stealth opened in 2006 and is now currently the world's fastest accelerating coaster. Um, a lot of people probably get confused on that one. It happens quite a lot in the comments. Um, it is only 80 miles per hour, so it's not the fastest roller coaster. It's the fastest accelerating coaster, meaning it gets from zero to 80 at a standstill point in 1.9 seconds. So there's not a faster one out there considering they've now closed Dodes Opener in Japan. Um, stealth is brilliant, guys. Front row seat for me, uh, front right is the best place on the roller coaster. Um, the back is also very good. The back's great for the drop. You get a lot of um, sort of airtime over the top. Brilliant roller coaster. Anyway, guys, let's take a ride on Stealth. Place your heads back, face forwards. Three, two, one, go, go, go! Is Hyperia going to beat a front row on Stealth? That's a tough one. Now, a lot of Americans and uh, Europeans will say Stealth's not that fast and it's quite tiny. Um, I mean, personally, I do prefer Red Force at Port Ventura, but what everybody needs to remember is, as I say, this is the fastest accelerating coaster in the world. So with it being that small as well, you hit it at a lot of force and zero to 80 in that, in that sense of time, it is a brilliant launch coaster guys there's nothing like that launch on stealth and with hydraulic launches dying out we gotta enjoy it while we can anyway time for a ride I love stealth, guys. Uh, I love a, I love a front row as well. I was on the back that time, but I've actually ridden it six times today whilst I'm recording this video because it is literally just walk on. So there's stealth, guys. I absolutely love stealth. There's nothing else like it in the park. Uh, 
A lot of the other rides here are good. They are very good rides. They're very cool. They've got a little bit of airtime. Mostly frills and inversions uh, for Park. But Stealth is just like, there's some adrenaline and that is why I absolutely love it. So guys, that is three days now until Hyperia opens. Stay tuned. We've got a few more videos left and I'll see you next time. If you did enjoy today's video, don't forget hitting that subscribe button really does help.